Hey guys, Shieldy here, and this is uh, the first video on my channel, and uh, this is going to be Let's Talk Cod Ghosts. Uh, basically, whenever I feel like making one of these, I will, or whenever any more information comes out. But uh, first of all, as you see on the screen here, this is just going to be a still video, so um, we've got this picture of Cod Ghosts, the teaser of some of the perks. So, um, going from the top left, where it looks like sort of a spider's web sort of thing, I'm sure, to me, this looks like what was on Modern Warfare 3. It was called Recon, or I don't, it might have not been, but it was where if you threw a flash grenade or threw some sort of grenade and hit someone or stunned them, it would um, show them up on the map as sort of what you now know as a VSAT or a Blackbird. So you would get, I think that sort of looks exactly like it, so I wouldn't be surprised if that was making a return. And then underneath it, you see two men in a magazine underneath. So there's, I've seen a lot of videos over this one. I, personally, I think it's um, probably a running reload. So as you're on the sprint, you can reload, which will be a new feature at the card. But you never know. It could be something else. It could be like a marathon or could be something completely different that no one's even thought about. Then underneath that, uh, you only see about half the picture. But the me, it sort of looks like a boat being struck by lightning. So or something being struck by lightning. But it could be like a UAV jammer or something. It could be like a UAV jammer or a counter UAV jammer. I couldn't really tell you exactly. But um, I'm not too sure. I, it could be, but it's obviously, like I said, nobody knows for sure. And it could have many differences before the release. Then at the top of the screen, you see a little X. If you sort of remember this from uh, Modern Warfare 2, this sort of represents Commando from what we can see. But obviously nobody knows yet and you can barely see it, it's only half of it, but just from what I can presume and remember from other cards, it may actually be Commando, which I will not be happy about. And then underneath it we'll have a man in sort of a gas mask with a knife. Um, this sort of reminds us of Assassin from One Warfare 3, so it could be something to do with that, but I've never seen the knife on it, so I'm not too sure. But you could, or it could be, or it might not even be anything like it. And the one underneath here, the one underneath that, the big sort of gun looking thing. Uh, personally, I think this is sort of like a bandile bandolier from like World at War or Card 4, where it gives you more ammo to start with, sort of like what the new Scavenger Pros sort of came to be. And then there, going on to the next one, at the bottom right of the screen, there's a vulture with two bullets, obviously meaning Scavenger is making a return as usual, but in a sort of a new sort of picture now, and it looks quite good, a new revamp. Then above that you see a grenade and a shield and obviously this is either going to be blast shield or flak jacket. But I would I would prefer to see blast shield come back as a tactical or a lethal grenade because I don't like having flak jacket as a perk. I would prefer blast shield where if you press RB or R1 um, it takes away your hood and you can have protection. But you never know, you, it might be one, I'm just guessing here. And the, finally we'll have the one above that where it's sort of a a skull with sort of a radar what i'm thinking here is once again another modern warfare free perk of um I, I couldn't tell you exactly what it is but what used to happen was after you it was a death streak and as you've died once more the last time you got killed um it would show your your re last killer on the on the mini map as sort of a new blackbird or a vsat so instantly you would know where he is but obviously you can never tell but it does look suspiciously like it so uh, guys, that's all of them wrapped up and expect a few more videos over the next upcoming days to get this channel off and started. So thank you, don't forget to subscribe, like and leave a comment of any feedback and anything you'd like to see. Thanks, bye.